Hi everyone. So I'm sharing with you my mommy nighttime routine. So I start at 8 p.m. basically every single night after Penelope is in bed. So I just start by closing the blinds and normally I actually clean up with Penelope, but we had a whole situation tonight. She had to have a second bath. So I just cleaned up all the toys by myself. So I like to get everything tidied up. Then I will sit down and quickly write out my to-do list. So this is kind of a combination of like what I want to get done the next day, but also like things that I've had on my mind that I need to get done that don't necessarily have a time frame. Um, but I just love to write everything down and just have it on paper. And I love making this part of my nighttime routine. I can see everything clearer. Trying to fly cause I'm light as a feather. But I can't hide. I can't look at the same time. Feels so right, then I'm wrong. Hoping I'll be fine. But I get out. I always do. I never think. I always do. Never thought I would. Now I'm folding the laundry. I normally have at least a small little pile of laundry sitting on the couch so I was just sitting here watching some YouTube and folding the laundry I was able to put away some of the towels and things but um, the clothes I'll have to wait to put away in the morning because I don't want to wake up the little girl so get into my skincare and shower routine so I absolutely love these vanity lights that I have and just like how dim they are and it just gets me in such a relaxed mood and just I feel so peaceful and just really enjoying this quiet me time so <laughs> I'm just taking off my jewelry and then I will get ready to brush my teeth. You guys, 
If you are not using a tongue scraper, I highly recommend it. So I really love to take my time and do a really good oral cleaning, if you will. So <laughs> I never used to be someone who would floss every single day and now I floss every morning and every night and I'm telling you it feels so good you guys so if you're not flossing regularly please do it's so worth it and then <laughs> I absolutely love this mouthwash it's so great I like gargle in my mouth for one minute and then in my throat for 30 seconds and it's it is truly amazing mm -hmm. For my skincare, I use The Ordinary products. I absolutely love them. Um, so I use the Squalene Cleanser. Um, so this one is a face cleanser and makeup remover. What I love, it's so amazing because you literally like rub it in your fingers for a little bit and it will melt like into an oil and it just feels so good like so moisturizing but at the same time cleanses so well um i wasn't wearing makeup today but um it does really easily remove mascara so it's a really good cleanser i really love it <music> shower I so I only wash my hair once a week as you guys might know um, so Saturdays are like my full reset days and that's when I wash my hair so um, after my shower I will go in with the ordinary multi peptide plus hyaluronic acid serum so I went on their website and I took like the quiz and it will literally give you a full skincare regimen based on your needs so um after that i will use the amino acids plus b5 so these serums are really great just for anti-aging and um dehydrated skin so i absolutely love them and again like this whole routine is just so peaceful it's so therapeutic for me and then for moisturizer i use their natural moisturizing factors plus hyaluronic acid and i always make sure that i do my face and my neck as well <music> Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. It is so thick, so nice and moisturizing. And then I will put some on my cuticles as well. This is also my favorite thing to do at nighttime is 
give my hair a really good brush. So I am trying to grow my hair all the way down to my waist. And so, you know, I'm doing all these things. I'm trying to only wash my hair once a week and I'm trying to use, you know, little to no heat on it. And so I just think it's really good for your scalp to really take the time. Like I will, I will stand here and brush my hair for like 20 minutes, basically until my arm can't move anymore. <laughs> And it really does feel so nice. So I do this every single morning, every single night, and I just brush, brush, brush my hair. <laughs> making myself some sleepy time tea it is so good and it really just relaxes me and gets me in the mood to just read a good book chill out and enjoy this mommy time by myself my favorite podcast right now girls gone bible it is so good i absolutely love it so i'm watching all of the episodes and then i'm filming with my phone but normally this is the time that i will really sit and respond to comments on my channel and you know engage with you guys <laughs> that I'm actually starting in this video um, and then this is the Bible that I read if you guys are interested um, but I have been thinking about potty training Penelope for a little while now and I feel like I really want her to be potty trained before she starts daycare so for some reason, I'm totally procrastinating. Um, <laughs> so I finally decided to open up this book and just at least start with reading and see what the signs of readiness are and all that fun stuff. <laughs> to end my evening reading the bible it is so so good for me it's it's crucial that i start my day this way and i end my day reading god's word so if you guys are struggling if you're feeling alone or you don't know what your purpose is i highly recommend it accept jesus into your life read the bible it's life-changing but yeah thank you guys for watching this nighttime routine i really hope you guys enjoyed it Please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!